tomorrow in this building, we will be welcoming back our cabinet, our, all of our cabinet, all of our deputy ministers, all of the First Nations chiefs in British Columbia to this building for our third annual meeting of, of First Nations. We call it the All Chiefs Gathering. And we're the only place in the country that does this. And we are proud of that because we are also proud of the fact that we are home to one third of Canada's First Nations. And that is part of make, finding our way on the road to reconciliation between First Nations and non-First Nations people. It is not a straight road, it's a sometimes a bumpy road, but it's a road that we are all determined to travel down together. And so today I want to make two announcements that are part of that journey toward reconciliation with First Nations. The Government of BC and BC Ferries are now committed to a new seasonal direct ferry service, direct ferry service between Port Hardy and Bella Coola. And we are also investing as part of this about $200,000 in the Bella Coola Airport to help them build a new terminal that's going to really be able to welcome people from around the world. I want to thank Premier Christy Clark, Transportation Minister Todd Stone and Tourism Minister Shirley Bond for the commitment and trusted place in our Midcoast Working Group that has dedicated time and attention uh, to creating a new tourism vision for Midcoast British Columbia. The announcement today created a, was created by a collective effort of First Nations and non-Aboriginal tourism partners that have agreed to work together to ensure tourism along mid-coast British Columbia grows. Aboriginal tourism doesn't grow in isolation on its own. It grows with partners in the non-Aboriginal tourism sector.